All right, hey, we're going to go baptize Charlie, uh, the 11-year-old that just came to know the Lord. And the cool part is that Scott, one of our team members with Town Revive, he's going to come and do the follow-up with his family and, and see if we can make that connection. It's a good day when the disciple maker is already taking the handoff from the initial follow-up. My son and he's getting baptized today. It's pretty, I'm pretty excited. I'm really, really. Well, I just met this family today, but um, I'm going to be their disciple maker, going to walk alongside them. So after we talked and we had met in the parking lot, I said, somebody wants, remember, we're going to help you grow in the Lord, right? So Scott here on our team is going to, he's intentionally said, I want to pour into your family. Nice. Because yeah. he lives in Middlebury. Middlebury. What did Jesus do for us? On the cross, right? He died on the cross. That's right. Charlie, you remember how we did this with you and your dad? Mm -hmm. Do you think, and you had said, can we can we go over this with Isaac? Hey, Sus? Yeah, yeah. Is that all right? Scott, do you mind doing oh, that? Oh, yeah. yeah. All right. Do you all have a wristband? Yeah. Yeah. And what do we see about the wristband in the Bible? Do you notice anything? They have the same colors. The same colors, don't they? Yeah. yeah. Do you remember what the yellow one stands for? Sin. And Isaac, can you read that for me? For all have sinned and for I mean, all... Sure. Does everybody mess up sometimes? Yes. Christ died for us. Died for us. How does your How does your mom or dad show you that they love you? By cooking for us and like cooking by for you and what else? Well, God said He loved us so much, He was going to send His Son to die for us, so that we don't have to. Think about something really bad you've done. Now don't tell me, but think about maybe the worst thing you've ever done. And God loved you so much at that time that he wanted to die for you to save you from your sins. Oh. <laughs> yeah, Charlie will help you. Oh, sin? Sin. And what about what? Death. Death. I didn't tell you what red is, but do you have an I idea? Know. I know. What's red? Love, very good. All right, we're gonna go to blue. Saved through, through faith. Imagine when I came to your house today, I brought a big box, a box that would barely fit through the room, and it'd sit right over there with a big wrapping paper and a bow on it. And I'd say, that's a free gift I'm gonna give you. You didn't have to earn it, did you? And he paid for it back at the yellow, or the of the red verse when it said God demonstrates his love that he died for us. That if you confess with your mouth Jesus as Lord and believe in your heart in your heart that God raised him from the dead you will be saved. He's giving it to you free and how you receive that is you just say I confess with my mouth which means you say it out loud. You just say Jesus I want you to be my Lord. Have you guys ever said that before? So if you guys want to say yes, we can say a prayer. And then maybe if it's okay with Dad, would, would you guys like to get baptized? Yeah. At the same time as your brother? What? Not the same time. <laughs> can I? Yeah. And you guys. He's just thinking about because he thinks it's fun. You, so. And this is a serious thing. This is not just fun. Oh, let's get baptized. And it's fun. It's You guys got to believe it just like the verse says. You got to believe it within your heart. Would you guys like to say a prayer and ask Jesus to be your Lord? Yep. Sure. You confess Jesus to the Lord. Just say, Jesus, I want you to be in charge of my life. Jesus, I want you to be in charge of my life. I want you to make me better. I want you to make me better. And I thank you for giving me life. And I thank you to, for giving me life. I thank you for loving me and dying for me. Thank you for loving me and dying for me. And I want you to help me live a, a life for you. To help you live a life for you. Amen. Amen. You're testifying to people, I'm not ashamed of Jesus. I baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy
gonna be going, looking, pushing forward with this, and I, and I like, I like the, what the kids just did today and things like that. So I'm, I'm excited.